Uh, it's, been, it's been nothing short of exhilarating, amazing, challenging, beautiful, all, all the big feelings throughout the past five years. Yeah, it's been amazing. It's been a, it's been a trying time, so it's so beautiful to hear people laugh and, and feel soft in their seat and with us. It's been a gift, really. Well, being from Detroit is one of the most inspiring cities to me in the world. Um, there's so much uh, invention of music and invention of art and community and a gathering and celebration of individuality and individ individual self-expression. That's where I come from. So that was a, a big pull to be reminded that, and that's what the film has brought, is this idea of honoring community and sacrificing and um, holding on to love. Well, there's so much inspiration in the movie, right? Like, there's so much the swiftness and the intensity, the stimuli, the aggression, the dancing. Was so, there's so much to pull from. Um, so you just take that energy and you try to honor it as much as you can. Um, but I played a lot with momentum and resistance and suspension because that's how I felt the what the cameras did, the whip panning of them, the rail cams, the steady cams, the, the constant shift of energy. You can do that in the body. So that was my through line inspiration. It is a dance show. Yeah, it's definitely a show that celebrates and allows the dance and the body to hold a narrative and walk through a story. And that's what I think is lacking sometimes, is, is celebrating an ensemble, knowing that these performers and artists can tell a lot, uh, not only orally, but physically. And this Moulin Rouge uh, honors that. And that's one of the main reasons why I'm so proud of it. They all bring such a different energy to it. And that's what's so beautiful when you get to share an idea with the world in many parts of the world. There's no, it's not a, a, a comparison or judgment. It's such a beautiful, they, they find themselves and their own in it as this family unit. And it's been so wonderful to watch the progression. They're such hard workers and they carry so much grit, <clears throat> excuse me, so much grit and dedication to it. It's been beautiful. I love them. Yeah, I've done I've done big, huge uh, tours and big productions before, but it's been so wonderful to be a part of the Broadway community. I've known many of, and I've worked with many of them throughout my life. So having this be um, my first Broadway show in something that I can celebrate as a, <clears throat> a dance show and an ensemble celebratory experience that's that's a true gift because like I said I'm a big advocate for honoring the dance definitely what's been so beautiful this round is because we've been in it for so long where there's a, a little bit more of a settling meaning I can re relax and pull back a little bit and watch what my collaborators have done and really hear and see and feel what my beautiful uh, community of collaborators have created and that that's been really wild to see like I've, I'm hearing music differently I'm hearing the words differently and I grab Alex and pull him or I grab Justin I'm like oh my god look at what you did it's so beautiful to, to be able to have that experience together there's it's so I, I honestly use this word too much but I'm really the gratitude I have to go around the world that people from all walks of life can be a part of it. That's that's a real gift. It doesn't happen often. If you want to walk into a space knowing you're fully welcome in it, all of you, every part of you is invited in, wanted, and heard and seen. That's, I think we could all use a little bit of that um, honoring of community. If you want to have nostalgia from music that you hear, um, and if you want to have an experience that reminds you that community is the heartbeat of the world, family and embodying truth is the heartbeat of the world and what makes the world go round. If you want to have those reminders, come see more. <laughs>